What's good, people? It's your man, Chef from Off the Dome, back in for another video. And today we're talking about opening up the state of Virginia, that's where I live, and more importantly, open up the world after the coronavirus. Now, obviously, I heard a lot of people say it's very selfish to open up now that numbers are going down, and it's going to make things worse. I agree, but I yet have to disagree. The one theory that the 5G towers may be the reason why the corona is spreading fastly is a theory you could take with a grain of salt, but yet... I was still thinking about it. We go back to the 1918 Spanish flu and figure out that radar was one of the reasons why that flu spread around faster. That's what some scientists are saying. People are looking at 5G towers and looking at it being airborne, possibly, and stuff like that. But you have to look at this. Although they say a lot of people are getting better, the majority of the coronavirus um, victims are asymptomatic. So that means a lot of people aren't going to go to the hospital. A lot of people are just going to go ahead and walk around with it. If they come up with some type of vaccine or continue to use the chloroform, whatever they're using to help people out, I think you open, excuse me, operate society like that. They're not nearly the amount of people that have died from flu, mesh coronavirus. It's not even close to flu still up here. The coronavirus is right here. Second point is this. I agree with a lot of governors. No count of the clubs and the concerts yet. They might have to wait till mid-summer, maybe the fall. I agree on that. No, for NFL games, stuff like that, you might have to... Maybe it could be half the amount of people you have the same, maybe halfway open stadium type deals where, let's say for the Cowboys Stadium, it's, it could fit about 11, 111,000 people in there. Maybe have about 56,000, spread them out a little bit. That might be one solution. Yes. But I don't think you can't say NFL could win us. It makes way too much money for a lot of states, a lot of people involved. I don't think the NFL will be canceled at all. I'm sorry, I don't think so. They got to look at the NBA and the NFL is something totally different. The bars and restaurants, you go up on restaurants, yes. Clubs and whatnot, no. Clubs might have to wait till the summer as well. Like I said, it's too many people close to come back together, dancing around each other. You don't have to wait for club night. But going to bowling alley, skating, as long as you cough at a certain amount of people, I think that's fine. Like the bowling alleys maybe cut off at 30, so everybody has every other lane to bowl. You're not too close. Social distancing, that should still be a thing for restaurants. For Mother's Day and whatnot, you have to allow maybe about 30 people at a time. Like I said, have people sit in this booth, they have another booth over here, they have another booth over here. Just redesign yourself in the restaurant. But generally, businesses, hotels, hotels have been open the whole time, but businesses as usual, some restaurants, some bowling alleys, some skating parks, some museums, they should open up. It gives people back their jobs. They get the economy back rolling. A lot of people are sitting at home wasting away right now. And to those people that say we need to stay in the house for the next couple months, maybe a year, a lot of those guys are tripping. I think they're tripping a lot. If we keep the social distancing, if we keep the masks and gloves, if we open up places that have a cutoff for the amount of people that could be in there for the next six months, I think we can still do progress. Now, life as normal with no restrictions, that's not going to be a thing for a while. I think that's not going to happen to December, maybe, if we keep going this rate. But a lot of states, you see a decrease in the hospitalizations. You see the deaths going down slowly but surely. And I think the government does need to go ahead and do something about it. I like Trump's decision to let each government decide when they want to open it. Because the federal government taking action is not a good thing. Some states are not ready. Some states are. A lot of states should go back to business as usual. They should take their precautions and go ahead and just live life to the fullest. Now, don't be stupid, of course. Still sanitize, still wash your hands. Don't forget to wash your hands. A lot of people, when it gets over, they're going to start washing their hands. Continue to be safe. Continue to be clean and do your thing. That's all I've got. If you have any questions or comments for me, make sure you do it in the comment section. I'm your man, Chef from Off the Dome. As always, I'll see you next time.